Hi, my name is Steve and I'm a cartoonist. I've been asked to say something about how I became a cartoonist and what role God has played in that. I've always liked the story that Jesus told about a man who gave his servants talents to look after while he was away. The talents in the parable were units of money, but of course today we call a talent something we're good at. The good servants in the story invested in their talents to make more talents and then when their master returned he gave them even more talents as a reward. I believe that God has given us all a talent or two. It might not be something we think we're good at but maybe something we really enjoy doing. I've been drawing cartoons since I was about five or six years old. I don't think I was much good at it but I enjoy doing it. I used to copy Walt Disney characters from a book I used to draw them on the kitchen floor because there was lots of space. No, sorry, not literally on the kitchen floor, but on a piece of paper on the kitchen floor. As I grew older, I got better at drawing and soon found that wherever I went, people would ask me to draw a cartoon for them. Then, as an adult, I was fine. I took my cartoons into all sorts of walks of life. One thing you'll find out about growing up is that life gets more and more complicated. I don't like it when life gets complicated, so I decided to try and keep it simple. There's nothing more simple than a cartoon, so I decided to make it my job. Maybe that is the advice I would give to anyone looking for what God has in store for their lives. Keep it simple. Find out what you're good at and enjoy doing, and keep on doing it. Do it for God and try and get better at it. Grow your talents as the servants did in Jesus' parable, and see what God has in store for you. I'm Stephen, I'm a pastor of a church in Morecambe. Now when uh, we get a call on our phone, we can decide whether or not we want to answer it. Sometimes we might know who's calling, we might think, oh, I don't want to speak to them. Now, or we might think we do want to speak to them. Now when God calls us, speaking to us through the Bible, through our prayer time, maybe through uh, other believers, I believe it's right that we follow him. We work out, actually, is this from God? And if it is a call from God, it's the right thing to do to follow. I believe God called me to be a pastor, so that's why I followed. And it was maybe not the easiest thing to do, but it's proved to be the right thing to do, to follow God's call. When I finished high school, I went to university and trained to become a nurse so that I could look after people in hospital. I didn't realise this, but I see now that that was God's calling for me. Sometimes God wants to use the things that we're good at and that we enjoy to serve and help other people. Another way that I believe I've heard God's calling is in a worship meeting, a youth meeting. And I was singing the songs and listening to the speaker. And I remember really knowing that what God was saying through that meeting was very loud in my heart. And I wanted to say yes to Jesus and yes to following God's plan and purpose for my life.